Hey guys, we're back. We're gonna see if we can do this. Uh, my computer is freshly restarted, and only I only have Minecraft and OBS running. So I'm hoping that I won't lag every two seconds. Um, so that would be great. I I have. Oh gosh, I have to think of things to tell you. Um, I have a corgi poo. She's pretty cute. Not that that's helpful. I mean, whatever. Um, this be a good book, this world data. I've taken a long time to read it. Goodness. Um. <sighs> yeah, there's a lot that I have to talk about now that, um... I got nothing, guys. I'm so sorry. This this is this is awful. I wish I wish that you guys could just say talk about this, talk about that. But it's pre-recorded. You know, maybe like after I post a few of these and hopefully start getting comments. I don't know. Um, who knows? Okay, back to the game. Yes, can we take some steps? And not crash. Oh, oh, it looks like we're doing it. So this giant thing over here is um, a skeleton, which is pretty cool. Um, I don't know that I'm interested. Actually, I'm going to double check. Okay, yes. Like I said, in the first little half an episode, um, I don't, don't do very well when I just get attacked by monsters out of nowhere. Um, so I prefer to do more of a like creative method, only not creative, um, where monsters don't spawn. Um, if they could spawn and just wouldn't attack you unless you attacked them, that'd be great, but we all know that's not how it works. So um, I am looking for terrain. I am looking for villages right now. I am just in an explorifying sort of mode. Um, but obviously this is a desert. Um, okay, well, I guess, you know, we can talk a little bit about um, All the Mod 6. I don't know if you have played it. Um, if you are, like at your job and you love Minecraft so much, you're trying to just imbibe it as much as possible. I've been there. And so like you just have a YouTube video of someone playing Minecraft while you know, you're you doing your thing. That's it, I ran into a cactus. Um, ah, yay, we found some terracotta. Um, I think that's terracotta, probably. Um, you know, if that's the case, I hope you <laughs> like the way I play. I hope I'm interesting enough for you. I am going to need a pick. Okay. Um, you guys are going to learn that I, my train of thought is like five trains. Just FYI. There is like no caboose and, you know, two engines pulling on either end. It's going to be a wild ride because I don't remember what I was talking about before. Um. Well, I guess, uh, so this mod pack has a few fun mods um, that I really, really like. Uh, one of them is a mod, I don't know what it's called. They'll tell you on Reddit if you um, look it up. Um, but there is one mod that if you, using either your fist or an ax, if you punch a tree, at the spot where it hits dirt. So like if I punch here, um, it won't cut the whole tree down. And I think also if you press shift while you're doing that, it won't cut the whole tree down. But if you punch the block that is right above dirt, um, it will chop the entire tree down and it will still use up, like if you have an ax, it will use up your ax. But uh, you don't have to sit there and like nerd pole up and like jump and look like an idiot. It's really nice. So I appreciate that mod. Um, there's also a mod called vein mining, which, uh, let me, let's see. I don't know how many I'll need, but let's, uh, let's get 
some wood. Let's get our crafting table. Um, eh, meh, whatever. Like that. Okay. Okay. We'll just leave that there because I'm sure we're going to get a stone pickaxe. So the vein mining mod is awesome um, because you can press the uh, tilde key, which is the one under the escape key, and um, aim at something, and it will mine like all of it within an area, either um, all of it like within the area or until your pick is used up, which is what happened to me. My pick got all used up. Um, what is, is that Jasper? That is red rock. Can you use red rock to make? I don't know. I can try. Sometimes experimenting is fun. Ah, that's nice to know. You know what? We'll just do that. Because I'm sure I'm going to use it all. So now, um, I can come here and just do like this number and get all of that terracotta and I don't have to do it piece by piece. Like you can see now my pickaxe with one swipe is in the yellow, which is fine because I would rather have it. Uh, it's a lot faster. So it helps with um, the grindy bits. Um, you know, the the Minecraft twerking, if you will. I don't know. I have no clue. Um, but it is really, really nice, in my opinion. <laughs> um, this vein mining mod. Um, and I will be using it all over the place. Um, and actually, it's really cool because, like, if you want to do um, other types of mining, so you can do, um, you can actually change the shape that it does. Um, so if you press it um, up in the right corner, nope, left, left-hand corner, I am directionally challenged. Um, you can press shift while you're holding the tilde key, and then it gives you options. So now it's like one long tunnel going through. Um, this is... Uh, reminiscent of the Tinker's Construct um, bigger tools um, you've got a mining tunnel which is like the staircase down but I think you have to do that a couple of times if you want to fit and there's a scape tunnel which is a staircase up also have to go a couple of and then this one um, the shapeless is of course if you have like uh, can I find one let's see if I can find um, like a vein ah there's one um, I thought I saw some around here. So um, if you have a vein of a mineral you're interested in, in this case right here we've got coal, we can press this when it's shapeless and it will mine all the coal. And it's another thing that's really nice is that it, um, it mines it like diagonally. So uh, you can get stuff out without having like giant holes everywhere. Um, so there's lots of uses for that mod. That mod gets two thumbs up for me. Three if I had them. I don't. And I didn't make an axe. What? Oh, yes. Sometimes my fingers don't go on the right buttons and it is disastrous. I will maybe tell you guys a story about that. How much? Should that be enough? I don't know. So one of the mods that I added, because all the mods, um, you know, their disclaimer is that they don't have all the mods, which, you know, 1.16, 1.16, I don't know how you tell, say version numbers, whatever, 116, uh, obviously doesn't have all the Minecraft mods, like, finished quite yet, um, but, um, but there is a mod that, um, is not ready for it, and that is the, uh, bonsai pots but bonsai pots were only for trees anyway um so there's another mod that i have discovered that i really like called botany pots um and it allows you to grow crops i've no, i haven't tried saplings in it um but um it allows you to grow crops in little pots um and it has the hoppers too so you can collect them which is really really nice um but you need terracotta for that um so, and then, so that's why I'm collecting terracotta, because I anticipate that being one of my early tech modifications. Um, I think probably what I should be doing right now is looking for a base site, a site for my base. Um, and I'm pretty particular about where I build my base, because I like for it to, like, look nice. Um, 
so I don't like building bases in deserts. I, I understand the value of picking a good spot based on like features, but also, if I don't like going there, what's the point of picking that spot? Got that egg. Um, so, I, I tend to prefer like the coloring in, oh, like plains biomes or lush biomes, that sort of thing. Not, not a huge fan of like the taiga biomes. Um, I'll go there for, you know, trees and stuff, but found some horses. There's a pumpkin. Oh, I didn't mark my spawn point. Well, that's all right. <laughs> We're going this way. I mean, it's not like you guys have a choice, right? Um, I've never, I've never actually done anything with horses. Maybe I will. I don't know. Um, I guess the nice thing about the rats mod is that, like, when you get tired of them and you kill them, the plague doctors have rats on a leash, so you get some leads. But also, I feel bad, like, you know, killing their pets and stuff. Um, but I don't like the holes they make in your houses. Um, I will probably need some sheep for a bed soon. Oh, my word. Let's see. Mm. I'm gonna check my map real quick. Oh, this is the end. Let's see. I could go that way. I could go that way. There's a big muddy. Hmm. So my spawn point was probably somewhere around there. Let's see. Mm. I don't really want to venture out across the ocean quite yet. So we'll go south. We'll cross the Terracotta Mountains and see what's down south of the Terracotta. I guess that means I'm probably not going to come back here. And it might behoove me to get some... Um, to get some wool. That's what it's called. Guys, it's called wool. It's called wool. Could not remember. Oh... Um, it might behoove me to get some wool uh, before I leave this sheep infested land. Oops. Um, thank you. Um, there were more. There were more sheep here, guys. I thought there were. No. No. Okay. There's one. No. I want to go south. I'm not chasing that thing. Uh, there's a wolf. Um, there are more wolves. Wolves, guys. Oh, he killed a sheep for me. So I did not have to do it. Um, so I upgraded to 1.16, Minecraft 1.16, because, um, I had this, like, enormous um, place in a all the mods 3 remix thing, which is 112, and I could not for the life of me figure out village or mechanics. I was trying to, like, have a village on my base so I could trade with emeralds and stuff, um, and I just could not figure out. Oh, there's a lag. Guys, I'm so sorry. It went a long time, though. We did, we went, ah, there we go, thank you. Uh, which way was I going? That way. Um, um, I could not for the life of me figure out how to get anything other than, like, the, you know, most basic farmer, fisherman, whatever villager. Like, I had, I had all of the stuff, um, that I was, you know, that all of the wikis told me I needed, and they were wrong. They were very, very wrong. Um, because none of it ever worked, and all I ever got was, like, the level zero villagers from the villager uh so what i did was they have like they had the wands 
and I moved a spawner um, to my base and then I went and like captured a mob and somehow like changed there's a spawner changer too I think actually additions um, is a mod that I really really miss um, it had a lot of really cool stuff in it um, even if it was just like storage crates and stuff um, don't have those you have to do like diamond chests which as you might assume requires diamonds um, and so they are not one of the um, like first things that you can make you just have to have a lot of really big chests you have to have a lot of double chests for a while till you get enough diamonds but um, it's all right I'm sure we'll find some pretty soon we've got this awesome vein mining thing um, and yeah I'm hoping that we can have a lot of fun with this let's see I have no idea how long I've been going does it tell me I'm sorry I'm looking over at OBS right now I guess I can technically kind of play in OBS does it tell me how long I've been recording 16 minutes um is that long enough guys is it long enough for you like I'm one of those that's like two hours sweet let's do this one so mm. but I know that apparently in like podcasting land and YouTube video land um you know, there's like a limit, like 30 minutes, you know, 20 minutes. What? What kind of trees are those? I actually don't think I've seen that kind of tree. Um, I've done a bit of exploring in other areas, like in another world that I made. So like I said, I had a little practice and I don't know that I've seen this tree. Is this just like a giant? Holy cow, that is a huge tree. It is a baobab. Baobab, guys, look at that. It's stinking enormous. There's absolutely no way I'm going to get one of those saplings. So a cool thing that you can do though, um, what you can do, let's see, I do have a piece of dirt. Um, I'm, we're going to take a shortcut guys. I'm not going to do this by hand. We're going to get an, <laughs> we're going to get an ax. Um, so actually we're probably going to need like several. Oh, well pff, that wasn't helpful. Okay, I guess we're going to get two axes, not four, like I thought. Okay. Um, but what you can do is, um, let's do that. Let's see. Um, I guess this might take a little while, guys. Sorry. Um, but I will try to explain what my plan is. So what you can do with this um, tree cutting down mod is, um, oops, nope, I don't want to do that. Um, let's see. You can take a piece of dirt and put it underneath a, um, log. So I can, like, do this little, like, staircase cutting up to the top of this. <laughs> and uh, when I get near this app, near the um, <sighs> leaves, when I get near the leaves, I can plonk my dirt under um, one of these logs and then chop the log above the dirt. And it'll chop down the rest of the tree above where I plonked my log. Um, by the way, I hope you guys don't mind the word plonk because I probably will say it a lot. Um, but I don't foresee, uh, I don't foresee having a lot of extra. All right. I think we're probably, well, we're probably close enough, but also I need to make sure that I can actually like reach above the dirt. So maybe like this. Nope, that's not dirt. Guys, that's not dirt. I got this, guys. We're good. We're good. I promise. I, there we go. Alright, dirt. Um, hang on, guys. My corgi poo is chew, chewing on a 
cardboard box. Hey, don't do that. Get away from there. Okay, I got this, guys. We're chill. We're cool. <gasps> it does take longer to do, like, giant trees, as you can see. Um, but that just did not, that just did not work. Okay, we tried. Did it get the whole tree? What? Um, it looks like it tried to get the whole tree below where I chopped. That wasn't my goal. Guys, that was not my goal. Um, hmm. Let's see here. Um, nope, I don't want to climb up there. Um, so they do have the, they have these really cool things where you, you let's try that one. Um, they, they do have the, like, underside, but it's really hard to get. Um, it's not very common at all. This is going to take the one that I'm standing on, I bet. And I'm going to fall to my death. Oh my gosh, guys, I fell to my death. <gasps> okay. Here we go. Can we get there in time? Oh, I have an obituary. Um, does it show me where my death is? It's that way. Okay, latest death. Oh, God. Guys, I should have stopped. I can't believe I did that. Ah, I feel like an idiot. Bambaland. Um, I don't remember what I was saying before I fell to my death. Um, yeah, it's gone. It's gone. Well, what's nice now is that I'll have this cool little, like, thing from my face to put on my base wherever I land, wherever my base is. Anyway, um, I remember we were talking about the, the tree cutting down thing and the hack with the, ah, oh, there's a waste down. I don't actually know how to use those, but every time I find one, I right click it. Is that what you're supposed to do? Well, that's what you're supposed to do. That's what I'm doing. Mad Murmur is what it's called. Guys, I did it. I don't know. I don't know. There, Yeah, there's a lot that I just, <laughs> that I don't know what's going on with these things. Um, feel free to instruct me because a lot, of, a lot of the time, like, I go looking for how to do something on the internet and, I mean, honestly, like, Google is just not that helpful. Sometimes the only way that you know how to do things is by watching people's YouTube videos. And if you want to know how to kill yourself by chopping down a baobab tree while you're on it, I have shown you how to do that. So, you are welcome, internet. Let's see. Oh, we're so close. There was a lot of wood on the ground. I don't, I don't know if I'm going to... I don't know, there are some colors of, like, wood that end up looking kind of sickly, if that makes sense. I don't know if it does, it might not. Um, that, that was a failure. Um, nope. Oh, for heaven's sake, guys. I, there's a big mountain in my way. Um, and I'm not a huge fan of, like, the sickly colored woods. I don't, um, I prefer ones that look rich. The aesthetic that I tend to like is um, like a fantasy sort of one. So if you're here hoping for like some sort of po po post-apocalyptic, if I can get, I can get words out, guys. I can talk good. Um, if you're looking for some kind of post-apocalyptic uh, atmosphere in our base, like that's not happening. I'm sorry. It's gonna be like elves and hobbits and you know, fairies and stuff. Um, which is why I like to explore to find a base first. I'm gonna get there. I'm gonna get there, guys. I promise. Anyway, um, so like I don't even, like I didn't even get to check. I don't even know if I like the color of all of this baobab wood. But um, the way I feel about saplings is sort of a Pokemon vibe. Like, gotta catch them all. Like. Even if I never actually grow another sapling like this, I just want to make sure that I have the opportunity. I want the option to grow this sapling. Oh gosh. Don't, let's not kill ourselves again, huh? Right? Like, that'd be a good idea. This is, this is bad. 
this is how this is what it's called a bad idea um, yep bad idea we are gonna figure stuff out I promise guys we're gonna do it hmm let's see I need water water's what I need does anyone have any water oh for heaven's sake well now I don't have any more dirt On a cliff, guys. <laughs> this feels like a really dumb quandary. Oh my goodness. I'm on a cliff. I can't get off. Um, let's see. Okay, so I've got I've got dirt and I've got coarse dirt. Let's see. Yep, we're doing this. I'm pretty sure we're doing this. You guys totally saw us coming, didn't you? And we're like, okay, um, you need to find a different way down. Um, yep. Well, you were right. I do need to find a different way down. Oh, so much for that whole, like, 15-minute thing. Yeah, that didn't work out. Let's go down this direction. Maybe we can find an easier way down here. Who knows? Does anybody know? Um, also, I'd like to apologize in advance because I'll probably sing a lot because I'm like super not used to, you know, speaking. Um, hopefully you guys will help with that. Like, thanks for being my guinea pigs. Um, but um, in times when I don't know what to say, I might just sing stuff. And I'm under the impression that I cannot always tell when I'm off key. So if I sing something and it's just ridiculous and you have one of those super duper sensitive ears that can tell the difference between right music and wrong music, I am so sorry. I would like to apologize in advance. Um, hopefully it will become endearing and you guys will stick around. I think, I think maybe we've done it. I'm always impressed by some of Minecraft's um, really cool, like, rock formations and stuff. You know, got floating islands and things like that. I'm really, really hoping that there's at least one sapling down there still. Please, let there be one sapling so that I don't have to climb all that stinking way again. I, guys, I don't see a sapling. There's me. There's me. I wonder if I collected any saplings before I died. I collected a lot of wood here. There's wood here, guys. I need so much wood. Um, um. Actually, I don't... What does the wood look like? Does it actually... Does it not look that different than birch? I don't know. Maybe I'll use it. I was looking at it, and I think that these guys might be, like, pretty awesome to use for, um, like, tree-based buildings. I don't know. Yes. Um, do I have to click? I don't, okay. That's all my stuff. Um, nope. No baobabs. No baobabs. Mm -hmm. Um... Well, maybe I should just, I don't know. I, uh, I already told you guys that you didn't have to nerd pull up, but maybe I should just nerd pull up and like chop down some leaves because I don't want to die a hundred scary deaths <laughs> to get 
Ah, oh, sapling. Oh my goodness. Um, let's see. Let's see if we can do this, actually. We'll try something else. Mm -hmm. Let's see. Um, Alright, well, I tell you what. Before we try something else, I'll just call this a day right here. And I will say farewell and see you next time. And we will conquer the Bao Bao sapling. I promise. Um, so thanks for the actual first episode. I waved. You guys didn't see it. Um, but um, I will see you sometime soon on the flip side. I don't know why I like the phrase on the flip side. Does it show my age if I say I think it's cool? I don't know. I don't know. Okay, I was thinking way too hard about that. I'll see you guys around um, next time.